Tuesday or Thursday, which going forward, there Tuesday and Thursdays, uh, those are gonna be nights where if there's nothing going on, if I go to the gym, I'm feeling like it and all that, then I'll I, I will stream. Before they get to the if village. not, like if there is something that comes up, it's and it's on a Tuesday and Thursday, then I won't. Um, it seems to work out because then I can plan things like this where day like today I was able to come home go on a quick run and then go out to eat or not go out to eat but uh, eat something and then be here so oh god I can't even see uh for youtube i'm thinking of replaying some games i got never got to finish oh okay that's always a good decision that's how that's how i feel about some of these older games that i never even got to play like some of them i don't know if it's gonna be worth streaming but like i still kind of part of me like streaming will always be my number one thing but like part of me says like hey maybe you should just play this in your spare time and record it and then do it for youtube instead but i don't know i still haven't like figured that out perfectly yet um it's a cool idea though it's definitely one of those things where it's worth doing Um, oh God. There we go. That's what I was trying to do. This, this grass is like pretty tall here. One sec. Here, what up, bad? How you doing, man? Welcome, welcome. <laughs> wow. Not bad. Uh. Why is he defend from soldiers? Oh. Now I'm being attacked by. Did I just fail the mission right there? I'm pretty sure the bear just killed him. Chillin', so YouTube is chill. I enjoy Twitch, but I'm not really good at live commentary. I think he was a friendly. But I totally just wrecked him in like one hit. Oh my god, this is a never ending fight here. Sorry, guys. Jeez. Yeah, I I honestly never thought I would be good at live commentary, but you kind of I feel like you kind of get used to it in a way um, I saw my moments where I go like dead silent or don't even know what to say too though But that comes with everybody um, I never even saw myself as streaming like years ago like ever I ne it never would have crossed my mind But here I am streaming for like two years now um, I've always wanted to do YouTube too, though. It's one of those things where like, it's, it's easier the way I have it set up for me to just look at my screen, press start, and then just start talking than it is for me to, uh, say, okay, I'm going to play this. I'm going to open up this. I'm going to record. I'm going to also open up this other program to record my voice and then go from there. Thank you, Alexis. So, I... I knew they were on the move, but I didn't think it would be so soon. I, I just have it so, like, streamlined that it's easy at this point. Tell me what needs to be done. We need a mode of transport across the Echeon. The ships we came in were taken when we arrived in Vora by not the bad you're good at. the docks. Perhaps we a little quiet at times, but not bad back. at all. Trust me. And your your stream, the one thing I really like about your stream also, Bad, is you're very professional about it. Like, 
every She's all of your character. stuff is very her professional her looking and like Bellini. it looks so and good to compared to all of these other people out there Word so is, he doesn't take well to mercenaries i can get people to like it's quality me. i'm sure you have your ways mistias like recording the video and enjoying the game then after the fact record the commentary so i actually know what to say also it helps because i can check how good the audio is true that is very true um i feel like i would be really bad at that though like doing a voiceover after the My fact daughter. or like i never she get to it loved the water. as a girl she always went i've never stopped wondering if she will come back to me there must be a reason why you're telling me about your daughter my feel she captains the skiller now. You're it's been years since I've heard from her. I, I, I pushed her too much, too far. And now it feels like I've pushed her away forever. She's an adult now. She makes her own choices. Don't blame yourself. Thanks for the kind words. You're now welcome, man. Isn't the time Thank you for the supporting me as well. I appreciate it, man. I'll go to Bellini and make myself useful. Hey, we all gotta support each other. Exactly. Yeah, Dev, if you start up that YouTube, for sure. I will be right there. Call me your first subscriber. Got you. Um, can I pay off this bounty? Yeah. Let's get rid of that. Uh, okay. So now we have to go all the way here. I feel like I don't know if I even just did a, a story quest. I might have just did a random one by accident. These are the the story, right? I think. Right? These aren't just like extra quests. These are like the, the story story. Or like the DLC quests. Ah, that's the... This is the order version and then these are the actual story. Okay. Yeah, we're we're good then. We're on the path. Uh, I just need feedback and suggestions of games. Uh, my biggest thing, honestly, if you want to do older games, dude, I don't know. Do you use Reddit a lot? Because if you don't, you should. Uh, but also, uh, Patient Gamers subreddit, one of the best subreddits out there for games that have been out for a while. Um, I literally love some of the posts like there's some people that write in-depth posts uh, about games that um the thing with being a patient gamer is their policy i mean obviously there's people that don't follow it 100 percent like myself but their policy is um you can't post or talk about any games that have been rele released within six months on the subreddit so all the posts on that subreddit are about are games that have been out for at least six months and a lot of them tend to be games that like like you'll see a lot of posts like i just saw a post about somebody that played through all the dishonored games and they're like oh my god to the person that suggested this like a uh a week ago or like a month ago thank you because you open like so many like that like somebody just played through Dishonored. I've seen a few posts about people playing through Mass Effect all three games for the first time, Dragon Age, like all these games that I love and and other people do. So that's a great subreddit. And they have a list of all the games for PS4, PC, and Xbox. And it just says, here's our most recommended by our community. Like, if you haven't played them before, play them. That's how I played uh, Portal. They were the reason I played Portal. 
Bygones be bygones, my friend. We drink! Except for the mercenary. Now, sail away from me! It seems like it'd be easier to silence. See? Your kind is always thirst. Violence is not always the answer. This is why I hate mercenaries. They think violence. I can still hear. Fine. <laughs> Calm down. What do you prove? Helping you would cost more than my left arm. If I am to risk incurring the Tempest's wrath, I heard valuables. Wah, 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 wah. I'd rather not run. Oh, oh, oh. A deal's a deal. I never. I'll give you your ships back. Thanks to you, me. Horondas. Mistios, no need for bloodshed. I just need you to come quietly, please. Releasing the stranded people has angered the Tempest. Take me, then. They have nothing to do with it. We have done enough. There's no need to escalate this further. Did you do all this? This destruction? All this ruin? It's painful to watch. It feels like she's becoming someone I don't know. I got chains thicker than his. No matter what happens, blood is blood. I feel like they constantly swap the choices of words. As foolish as I should have with the time cut, what will you Or like not the choices, but like one second the top one will be like a neutral one and the bottom one will be like aggressive. And then the next time it makes you choose it'll be the top one. Now the top one's the neutral one. Or no, the opposite. The top one's the aggressive one and the bottom one's the new like before it literally just said like I promise. He threatened violence to on the back. top one, and now he's like, I'll destroy I'm her so on the bottom. Like, they're constantly I switching it back I and forth. That. I guess to keep you on your toes. So you don't I just, like, keep pressing A. Nice. Uh. <laughs> Chains thicker than his. Support quest. I must go here. Now where is there? There's a show on map, right? Thought there was. Maybe not. Where is it? Boy? Um... I hit track. Oh, there it is. <sighs> I just went through my library and found 27 games I could play, throw a few videos. Uh, throw out a few videos and I'll ask for feedback and suggestions. Exactly. Uh, what are some, some games? Throw some names out. Also, if you wait, are you still play PS4, right, Dev? Um, I was gonna say if you have any like PC games that are co-op, I would gladly collab with you. YouTubers life. <laughs> Horizon Zero Dawn, Metal Gear Solid. Yeah, PS4. Is is Metal Gear Solid, is it, oh, is it Metal Gear Solid 5 or is it like the HD collection? Um, Uncharted, Last of Us, oh, okay. Have you played those games? You've played those games, right? Like it wouldn't be your first. Oh yeah, yeah. I, I will actually want YouTuber's life. <laughs> I, it's on my wish list on Steam, but I never got it. Phantom, some okay. Phantom Pain, yeah, that's a great game. Getting ready for something. Good, you're finally here. You mentioned something. I've been wanting to go back and play yeah. that on PC. I've heard that the Tempest Chief Engineer is developing a new weapon. A yeah. New weapon. Phantom Pain is a great game. For us. The gameplay is so much fun. Achaia. If he does want to escape. Maybe we can convince him to help us defeat it. He's attending the shipbuilding symposium at the Alpha Theater here in Ahea. Um, 
I've played only the first one and I have all four. I can head over to there seems to be a discussion. Uh, all four the are amazing. They, answer... <laughs> the they get they only get better and better too. So like if you play I'll the first the one, end. like at this point, the first one's pretty dated, but obviously it plays pretty good. Um the second one is pretty good. I think the the third one, I still have oh. I think I have a statue of the third one in my uh, my closet. That one's really good. And then the fourth one, my absolute favorite. I I loved the fourth one, and it plays so good. The story is so good. Everything about the fourth one is amazing. I've never played Metal Gear Solid until. Um, Until that one. Um, I felt really weird playing that one too because I I don't know I it was it was weird playing the story but like after you get into the gameplay like the open world and everything it's so dope you can go full on stealth like the entire time too which is really nice. Um, you could run entire okay. missions without shooting a single person. Um, and you can recruit people too, which is great. I never played the, uh... I'm just skipping through some of these, because they're kind of like... There we go. Um... I kind of want to get to like the actual main story of these. Uh, I'm really bad at stealth. <laughs> Another stealth game I want to go through again is uh, Splinter Cell. I want to play them so bad. One of these days I will. Um, they're they're pretty high on my like to do to do replay list, but at the same time I kind of want to replay them when like. I have a solid like five people always coming in to chat so that way we can all reminisce about it and not just like me oh god i'm not here i promise oh no that was such a bad idea that was such a bad idea i didn't mean to do that sorry i didn't mean to do that i actually did not mean to do that Why did he do that? This is probably the best. Oh my god, that was such a good ability to get. Oh no! no, 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 no. Sketchy. I can turn invisible now. So that's pretty cool. Peter, go to sleep, you're seeing things. Never played Splinter Cell? Ah, so, such good games. Amazing games. I played Double Agent like so many times too. Um, so here's my, here's my plan at the moment for games that I want to play. Um, Right now, I'm thinking about doing pretty much, uh, so Control comes out at the end of this month. I kind of want to get it and play it. So I, I think after I finish all the DLC for this game, if I have time, I'm going to play uh, Yakuza 2. And then after I finish that, then I'll start Quantum Break. If I don't and it gets close, then I'm gonna play Quantum Break because that's uh, Control made Quantum Break. The the company that made Control is making, uh, or the company that is making Control made Quantum Break, uh, and that's that's a game that I've been wanting to replay for a while. And I played it on Xbox, so I want to see what it how it plays on PC. Also. Um, Jeez, all right, I'm tired of. Dude, 
fear me. Give me the blueprints, and let me get out of here. Plans for the Himera's breath. Time to head back to the amphitheater. All right, goodbye. No. Bah, no. Gundam style. They must have found the engineer. Only he could decide for the weapon plans. So much for that. Literally. There's so many games to play though. So many games Look coming boys. out. So many games First to play. The There's it's never gonna stop. Better. That's Aren't like lucky. you kinda just gotta accept it, pick and choose your, your poison. Lucky isn't the word I'd use. Look who decided to show up just in time. Kill them! Kill them both! Kill them. Kill them both. I'll feed you to the throne. Oh there. Ah! 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 Uh, rage. Forever loving that ability. Oof. Takes a lot of hits. Jeez. Turn one hundred percent a bunch of games so I can get content out there. Two videos a week. That's um that's kinda what I've been or not the one hundred percent part because my logic on 100% in games is instead of spending time on one game because I have so many, I'd rather spend time going between them. That's just how I am. So I never really, I never really 100% games. The Tempest is more shrewd and careful than we expected. That's a, a very good plan. Um, that's something that I would like to eventually get myself into also. Doing streams Monday, Wednesday, Friday. And then on, say if I have like an hour on like a Tuesday or Wednesday or just weekends. The days that I'm off. Even like recording an hour long footage of something. And dropping that on Tuesday and Wednesday so that way the nights that I'm not streaming there's at least YouTube content coming out and then the nights that on the three nights a week that I can stream it's all set for that too so um, always start slow and, and build it from there because trying to jump into these types of things it never it's never easy and I feel like it never works out like how you really want it to i've been trying to stream for five days a week for like so long now and i can't tell you how many times like i i leave the gym to try and get home to get on stream and then i don't even make it in time and then i get down on myself and i'm like why am i even doing this so that's why i've gone to the three nights a week that's plenty reasonable like i don't have to go to the gym the days that i stream I can take my time, actually relax on Tuesday and Wednesdays, watch TV, do whatever. And then if I really have time and it, I'm not in a rush and I've got everything done, there's nothing going on in, on a Tuesday and Wednesday, I stream. Um, YouTube, I can't, I'm not going to say YouTube's easier because it's 100% not. In a way, it's almost harder because uh, especially if you want to actually make something of it and you're not just doing it for fun because they have so much higher standards than twitch i think just because you need like a thousand you need a thousand subscribers on youtube before you can even start to like apply um i mean i do this stuff for fun too but i would if i could make something of it i want to strive for that Look. um starts out as something fun but i want to take it serious to the point where like 
this is my second job in a way whether i make money or not this is what i do on the days that i say i'm going to and i'm gonna be there on the days that i do it so that way if it does turn into something cool if not i'm still enjoying it while i'm here um i don't know why these notifications are still going off when i have uh this Fire them. actually open but it's not stable Fire <sighs> them you stay here say it hard to do gaming videos now on youtube so i'm doing it for fun since i already game Fire. every day yeah that's literally how i got into streaming i said you know what i play video games every day why not streaming is becoming as popular as it is and it's only gonna get bigger so why not share my experience by tomorrow yes uh, admiral the skiller awaits my return but first i will inspect your work in the shipyards and see what else you idiots have managed to mess up move oh. The Tempest. This won't be easy, especially if they get that weapon to work. They couldn't even get it to work properly. It's only a matter of time before they succeed. We need to... Sounds like you have a plan. We need to go after her. If we can end things here, we're... We need to catch her. It's not too far. Come on. Uh oh. We were being watched. Doggo. Need to play something with some PS4 limitless some members. <laughs> yeah, dude. A nose bucket. Um, I'm surprised. We're actually getting a good. I I I put opened up recruiting on like the gilded page, and a good amount of people are coming through on that, which is kind of cool. Um. It's kind of hard though, getting people in. I wanted it to be local, but there's just simply not enough like local people. There's too many lo casual locals for me. So like, that's when I was like, you know what? Like half these people don't even take gaming seriously or like aren't that invested in it. So that's why I opened it up for like anyone. Dude, the Gilded app is so confusing and it has so m yeah, I completely agree with you, Dev. Um, it has a lot of potential, but like there's there's 100% a, 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 a lot of confusion to it. It's like trying to be Discord, but like for matching people with teams, but it's there's there's definitely a good amount of flaws to it. It's hard to navigate. I totally get it. Uh, Gilded app is essentially think of it as like a left or a looking for a group app or website. The thing that I hate is it like notifies you for every single thing that happens and I turn my notifications off all the way but I still like if I go on to the website I have 99.99 or 99 plus notifications I'm like bro I don't need all these like all I want is the basic stuff like if somebody joins I want to be notified if somebody uh, I don't care if somebody leaves um, I just want the basic stuff and <laughs> it tells you literally everything where else what am I missing it says if I go this way that's too far oh wait now it's saying it's not I don't mind playing with people and having fun as a team, but I'm more casual. I don't want to be the next ninja. They keep recommending a team, so I'm like, no, limitless all the way. <laughs> a I'm dedication. Woman who runs this place. 
Yeah, like things like that. That's what I mean.